Now we'll go to Tasmania where two farmers believe they have found what could be the world's woolliest sheep. Now the discovery was made on their property in Tasmania's Midlands and Lauren Day joins us now from Hobart to tell us about it. Lauren, where was this sheep found? Well, Kim, uh, Peter and Nettie Hazel found the sheep hiding in scrub on their property in Tasmania's Midlands. Uh, and, and they've dubbed it Sean. Now, the uh, normal sheep would have about eight centimetres of wool. Sean has about half a metre. Oh, so we're seeing some pictures now, Lauren. <laughs> yes. And yep, Sean has got quite a coat That's on. Absolutely. Absolutely. Needs a bit of a haircut. Uh, now, apparently, it wasn't too hard to catch him because uh, the wool has grown over his eyes, as I'm sure you can see. But the problem was uh, picking him up. He's got about 25 extra kilos on him with that giant fleece. So it's quite amazing that that he didn't get fly strike or, or heat stroke for that matter. But what's even more amazing is the tag on him suggests that he's come from a farm on the east coast, which is about 30 or 40 k's, I think, from the farm that he was found on. So he's basically uh, been, you know, on the run from the shearers <laughs> from all this time, it would seem. What does his future hold? Yes, he's been evading a haircut for a long time now. Uh, it's understood this week at some point a shearer will relieve him of that heavy load. Uh, and it's apparently pretty good quality wood, wool, surprisingly. I think there are about three or four jumpers worth there at least. So that'll go to some country shows. But he's also hoping to take out uh, the world title. Um, now, that's currently held by a New Zealand sheep called Shrek, uh, who had 27 kilograms of fleece yeah. on him. So we'll wait and see whether Sean can take out that world title. Yeah, come on, Sean. Surely he can do it. That's amazing. <laughs> uh, Lauren Day, thank you very much for that.